Hi guys, uh, Matt here, back with another video, and uh, just an update about the phone that I bought from Universal Gadget So One from eBay, and it uh, still works fine. It's a great phone, um, fully recommend it. But I just want to give the advice that when you buy this phone, make sure that you do a full factory reset on the phone, even though that when you buy the phone, it um, comes as the uh, Apple reset, and you log in. Um, and you sign and you put all your details in and set it up as a new phone it does actually remain uh, some of the uh, details of the previous owner do actually remain on the phone so make sure that you check everything uh, when I actually got this phone there are a few emails on there that I hadn't got from my um, current email that were from somebody else's and I thought oh it doesn't matter but what actually happened to me with this phone was their details were still on the uh, we're still on the Find My iPhone app, and then th this phone that I just set up came up on their Find My iPhone as a um, as a new device on their system. So they uh, were able to actually access this phone, and were um, able to access all the other devices on my uh, system as well as coming under theirs. So what they did was effectively held my phone and my iPad, which I have here to to ransom essentially so um, as you can see here there's this uh, feature called lost mode which basically locks um, the uh, devices on your system on your iCloud um, and then when you enable that you can just lock the device remotely and that's what happened to me and you'll see here in a photo that it was in Russian uh, it had email I um, was never going to uh, pay this money to um, get my phone and my iPad unlocked but um, they wanted 15,000 Russian currency, whatever that is, and I was definitely not going to do that. So uh, my next video is just going to be uh, how to actually um, get out of lost mode on uh, any Apple device. So just a quick message to say, be vigilant with this. Um, with, when you're buying off eBay, make sure that you do a full factory reset, which I'm going to show in my next video on my iPad, but it works for any um, Apple device. Okay, thanks for watching.